back to my channel today I am going to be doing my first wash and go and honestly I don't know what to expect I do not like gel so I'm very nervous I'm going to be using the extreme styling gel the reason that I do not like gel is because gel normally leaves your hair stiff it be flaky but this product says that it's made with aloe vera, it's alcohol free, it has a fresh smell, and it leaves no residue. So we will see. Right now, I only have leave-in and oil inside of my hair. And the only product that I will be adding is this gel. So let's get to it. So I really don't know what to expect because my hair is like a loose wavy pattern. But I really want my hair to be very, very curly and I want it to curl up. I just want that big look. Big curly look. So that is what I am trying to accomplish and that is why I'm going to put gel inside of my hair. I don't even know what method to use to be honest. I've seen shingling method, I've seen quite a few methods, but I just know I don't have time to shingle all of my hair. Um, you see what I mean when I say my hair is like a loose curly texture already, but it's not big curl. My hair is wet and I'm going to wet it some more. I'm going to try to do this in sections and as fast as possible. So I'm just going to add some water. And from what I've seen, I need to apply a lot of products. So that means I will be applying a lot of gel. I just hope that I'm not wasting my time. Like, I do not want my hair to be super hard and flaky where I'm going to have to wash it tomorrow. Because it's going to be a waste of my time. But, I'm going to give it a try. Again, this is what I mean by, like, my hair texture. So, I just feel like it's going to be a lot of little curls like this. And it's not going to get big like I want it to. By the way, my mirror is right here. So, that's why I'm kind of facing this way. Alright, here we go. It has, like, a... I don't know why I'm smelling the apple. Is this like green apple? No, I'm smelling the apple. I have no other gel to compare it to. Um, the slippage is nice. And I don't want to shingle my hair because if I shingle it and it turn out bad, then I'm really just wasting my time. I hope I'm not using too much product. Like I said, the slippage is good, but you know, I just feel like it's a lot of product inside of my hair already. I don't know whether to comb my hair, whether to brush it. I really don't know. Maybe I will try and start out with a few shingles, big shingles, that way they're not small. This is a lot of product. Good thing that this big bottle of gel only costs like $3. I'm hoping that, I mean, I'm thinking a lot of negative things about this hairstyle and gel, but I'm hoping that I am wrong and that I'm going to love this style. So the shingling method is actually taking quicker than I thought. 
So maybe I will keep up with the shingling just to make sure that my hair is actually curly and that it turns out well. This is how my hair is looking so far. And I must admit that it looks pretty nice. I just hope that it dries well. Hope that these results are worth it. All right, that is it. One side of my hair is fully done. I'm gonna go ahead and finish up this side and I'll be back when I'm all done. Okay, so I am all done with my hair and this is how the style is looking so far. Let me just tell y'all, I don't know who the world called this style a wash and go, but this is far from a wash and go because my arms are tired. Clearly a wash and go be washing my hair, doing something simple to it and walking by the door. This is not simple at all, especially if you about to shingle it the way that I did. But I shingled it because I'm hoping that the results will be good. 
But to be honest, y'all, I feel like I got a jerry curl on my head. And I'm nervous because these curls, I don't know. I just want to see the final results because I want to be proved wrong that this style is actually going to be pretty. It's going to give me that big hair that I'm looking for, the volume that I am looking for. And I just really hope that I didn't waste my time. And the last thing that I want is for my hair to be hard. And it kind of sort of feel like the few areas that is starting to dry already is kind of hard. It's hard, but... It's hard, but it's defined. The only thing I can say is that my hair is super defined. So, I do not own a blow dryer or a diffuser, and that is by choice. So, I have no choice but to sit and wait for my hair to dry, and it is nighttime, so I feel sorry for my bonnet and my pillow, because I don't even know how I'm about to sleep right now. But, I will be back when my hair is fully dry, and wish me luck, y'all. I hope that I'm gonna love this style. I hope that you all are gonna love this style and that I will do it again. Um, yeah, so wish me luck and I will be back. Okay, so let's get into this hair. My hair has finally dried and I just wanna show you guys what I do to it at nighttime. I just kinda put my big bonnet over the hair, but I tried to put my hair into a pineapple. So, it's looking like this and I just had a big scarf over it so let me just tell y'all that um, I don't really like my hair like I guess the gel was supposed to define it and it did do its job but I've been looking more into it and I don't like this crunch that's going on so apparently I'm supposed to break the cast and I'm supposed to pick out my hair so that is what I'm about to do because remember in the beginning of the video I said I want big hair. Like I don't really like what's going on with my hair right now. So what I have been told to do is pick it out. One thing I can say is that it didn't really flake up a lot. Um, let me just show y'all what's going on. You see it really is defined. So I guess if definition is what you're really looking for, definition and hold in the product, then yeah go ahead and gel your hair down but do know that it will be a little hard my hair is hard so i think what i'm gonna do is just try and separate some of my hair and i'm definitely gonna pick it out i had some bobby pins trying to hold down i call myself trying to do my edges i'm gonna release these bobby pins um so what i do is fluff out my hair and your guess is as good as mine as to how you really do that but from what I have gathered I just need to like go in and like let me get this last bobby pin I just need to go and like lift up my roots pretty much so I'm gonna go and fluff out my hair and I'll be back and I'll show you guys how it actually looks after i fluff it out because again i don't like it i've been getting a ton of compliments on my hair but i personally don't like it like i like my regular natural styles a twist style a braid out way better than this but i guess people really like it because of the definition i'm just not feeling how hard it is and i'm not feeling like this super curly look like i want the curls and i want the big hair so let me see if i can get that big hair and i'll be right back Okay, so quick little update. I am starting to like my hair now. Um, I am literally just taking a pick and I'm just picking all through my roots. And I'm also doing this to my hands. I mean, yeah, I'm like running my hands through my hair to just kind of break the cast. And I will let you guys know that now that I'm actually picking out at the roots, I am starting to see more flakes. Like, you guys can see these flakes right here. Um, white right here. So, there is residue, even though the bottle states that there is no residue, it is residue inside my head. But I just want to show you, this is me halfway picked out on this side compared to this side. I didn't pick this side out yet, so you see how flat it is. You see why I wasn't really liking my hair because it's so flat, so. I'm just kind of going to keep picking out i'm gonna go do this side and i will be back when it is fully fluffed out i'm just gonna keep picking 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 okay okay so now we're talking big hair so 
I realize that when it comes to a wash and go, or probably just when you're using gel, which in this case, y'all know I use the Extreme Professional Styling Gel, you need to pick out your hair because I feel like when it first dry and it's still looking crunchy, it got the cast on it, it's just, I just really feel like I had some jerk girls on my hair and that wasn't cool. So with it being picked out, I actually like this. Like, let me show y'all a little bit closer. And I feel like I didn't pick my hair out all the way because I know tomorrow as the days go on, my hair will get bigger. So I think this is the most that I'm going to pick it out. Um, but just look at it now. And like I did say, with picking it, you can definitely see more white in my hair. Yeah, you can see this white. This white here. So maybe that is one kind to picking out your hair earlier than it just naturally getting bigger on its own that it will leave white residue which it clearly states that it does not leave residue but it do so i think i'm actually liking this and i think from my first wash and go turned from me hating this style to actually liking it like i won't say that i love it but i like it i give it like a seven i still think i like my natural styles like my twist out my bantu knots um my perm rock set i think i like it over but i feel like it gives me a different look because you know my bands who not the perm rock that's big curls but this is actually little curls and it's actually cute so you know i may just tweak it up go fluff it out a little bit more but for right now my hair is big like i wanted it and like i'm used to and i feel like um with the with the hair just being dry and without me fluffing it out and without me picking it out i feel like i wasn't used to my hair just being that flat so that's probably why i didn't like it but yes overall i'm liking this style and for my first wash and go i did like it and i think i'm going to try some more so i will be testing out different gels i'm also going to see if you can establish a good wash and go with just a cream so that is to come that way you won't have to worry about your hair being hard and probably having to break the cast because your hair will be soft and it'll still be very fine like the gel did so i'm gonna test it out and do some trial and error so thank you all for watching my video i hope you guys are now liking my big hair i hope you all enjoyed this video and i will see you all later bye